In India's Silicon Valley, Bangalore, a hospital provides cell phones to health workers. They use the applications in remote communities, sending patient data back to the hospital for a diagnosis. The technology was developed with Harvard University to help find cancer in early stages when it's still treatable. Dr. Moni Abraham heads the Department of Cancer at Narayan Hirdyalia Hospital. He explains how it works. It's almost like an expert uh, going to the community and seeing the patient ourselves. So they take a picture. Then completing the, all the questions and taking picture, they press a button. And with the button, they can uh, uh, transfer the entire details into the uh, internet. M Health Alliance, a global consortium, and other promoters of mobile health technology see cell phones and other devices as a way to improve healthcare in areas where people do not have good access to it. It can facilitate healthcare in developing countries. But in affluent countries, the technology promises rapid healthcare too. It can help healthcare workers communicate with clinics. Doctors and technicians in the field can get advice on how best to treat a patient. The Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation has doled out billions of dollars to improve healthcare in developing countries. Bill Gates says cell phones and laptops can save lives. If you could register every birth on the cell phone, get fingerprints, get a, a location, then you could take these systems where you go around and make sure the immunization happens. In most developing countries, medical records are recorded by hand. Researchers funded by the Gates Foundation are working on a mobile phone-based vaccination registry. Health workers will scan fingerprints into a mobile phone so they can track people who have been immunized against certain diseases. The Intel Corporation has developed a mapping tool. An Intel spokesman explains how that could facilitate the work of health professionals. Today they go around with a clipboard and paper, whereas now they'll be able to take care of location of where the folks are, what, um, uh, what um, treatments they've had. Experts say mobile technology can provide a mosaic of services. The applications can be used to quickly relay medical data, transfer money and send educational materials to whoever needs them. Thierry Zilberberg with the mobile company Orange says the applications will depend on the health needs of specific countries. In Europe, we are uh, very advanced in the sense that these are commercially developed service available and we're making money out of it. Linking technology to health priorities could be the next step in making mobile health relevant. Vidushi Sinha, VOA News, Washington.